you already know what time it is. We are using my secret formula I just started using a few days ago. I have been doing a back blink and a harvesting tool that I think go really well together. We are using Pursuit and Battle Axe, as well as Laser Chomp. Not a huge deal with the glider, but I, I will pick a back blink and a harvesting tool. And this purpose of this secret formula is actually finding an outfit combination that looks good um, with a back bling and harvesting tool that match each other. So what do we get? Okay, um, not feeling this combo, but it's fine. All we gotta do is pick a default, go back to random and see what it gave us next. Okay, the Carolina Panthers, that looks really good, but we kind of knew it would because it's the same color scheme. Let's go back to uh, default and go random, see what we got. Uh, Red Nose Raider, it's not great. But this is kind of a formula people can use if they don't necessarily have a lot of options as to what to match together. So I will do, this looks great. <laughs> this is actually what it came with though, the back bling. So that kind of, that's kind of cheating. Let's do one more. This is a really good formula for people to kind of find um, interesting combos because, okay, that kind of goes too well again, but it's an interesting way to find combos that you wouldn't actually think go with an outfit. So let me change up the back bling and the harvesting tool and we'll try this formula again. All right, guys, really trying to mix it up. We are using the China Alpine Ace back bling with the Guiding Glow harvesting tool. Let's randomize our outfit and see what we get. Um, I'm not feeling it on Eon, not feeling it at all. Let's go default again and then put it on random so it will give us a random outfit. Reset it here. Um, it's not terrible on onesie. That's not terrible. I probably would have never tried that combo, um, personally. Randomize again, point it out, give it a twirl. Okay, not feeling this. Um, it's, it's not the worst, but like I said, if you're limited on outfits, um, you can kind of do this a couple times to see what it gives you and maybe it might show you something new. We already got this as well. Is this actually randomizing my outfits now? Okay, it is. Here we go, Scorpion. Um, it's not terrible. She does have a little bit of blue on her. I usually try to do a blue pickaxe, but you get the idea. Let's do one more, see what we get. Okay, this goes with everything, but if you really match the back bling um, with the pickaxe on something like um, Assault Trooper, this is what you're gonna get. It's gonna look really good. Let's pick a different back bling and harvesting tool and see what we get. All right, guys, now we are using the Runic Shield with the Spell Slinger Pickaxe. Let's see what it gives us for a random outfit. Um, okay, that's not very great. Let's try it again. Pointed out emote. Okay, everything goes on her, but it looks really good nonetheless. Very cool. Randomize again. See what we got. Um... <laughs> I probably wouldn't wear this, but um, it kind of it kind of opens up your mind creatively as to what you could actually use with certain um, pickaxe backlink combinations. So let's randomize one more time, see what we get. That's not what I wanted to do. Randomize my outfit, and all right, this looks uh, fairly good as well. Um, she does have the uh, light blue on her outfit, so let's pick another backlink and harvesting tool combo and see what we get for a match. All right, guys, really trying to use things out of the box here. We're using Night Cloak with the Golden Pig Skin. So let's show it on a default just to give you an idea of the gold scheme we're kind of going for here. All right, not bad on the default. Let's do randomized outfits, see what we get. On Canada, um, I could maybe see the golden and black going with the red and black. It's not terrible. Let's go default and then go randomized. What do we got? Um, Sub Commander. Purple and gold, it's not terrible. It's not terrible. Randomize again. Uh, default, actually, and then randomize. You have to go to default just so it resets your random outfit, guys. Um, I don't use this outfit a lot, honestly. Um, I probably wouldn't wear that, though. Just saying. Default and random. Pointed out emote. Let me talk to your manager. Part two. Um... I guess I could slightly see the gold matching, like the red and the pink vibe. Uh, let's point it out one more time. It's not the greatest, but it is kind of, it's broadening my creative mind 
because I really tend to only try to match things that I know has the exact colors on it I'm looking for. Oh my god, Leviathan, you're so nasty. I would never. Let's do one more. Oh man, I messed it up again. Let's go um, random, see what we got. Um, <laughs> Grill Sergeant probably wouldn't wear that either. But you guys get the idea. Let's switch up the back of pickaxe and see what we got. All right, guys, now we have the dark wings with the ice scepter. Let's see what it looks like on a default. Looking pretty mean. I mean, a default is a perfect example. There's not a bunch that matches defaults, like to the T, unless it's like a military outfit. Um, let's see what we got. Um, I mean, yeah, it's a little dark for her, but you kind of you kind of know that would probably match anyway. So let's go default and then randomize. Hey, there's a lot that goes on Maverick, actually. That looks pretty good. One more time, point it out. The reason I had pointed out emote on the end is due to being able to actually um, click and rotate. If I if I try to do the pure salt and get my mouse over here, I really can't see the emote, so I just put it on the end. Um, if you're on a controller, it doesn't really matter. You should just be able to highlight the emote and it should start it up for you and you can just rotate with your right thumbstick. So let's go default, randomize. Hey, everything goes on her, but now you know, right? I call it the zebra, the female zebra. Now you know. Default, random. Ah, uh, drift. I mean, I can see the purple going with the pink, all right? It's not great, but this is a perfect example of maybe you don't have a backling that might go really well with drift, like something that's white um, or maybe a little bit of gold or pink, but you do have like some, some blue and purple feathers with your pickaxe, it kind of ties it together. And that's the reason I'm showing you this video. Because I get a lot of uh, questions like, hey, what goes well with, uh, you know, this uh, back bling? What goes well with this? And I'm like, well, you just kind of have to experiment and see what you come up with. This looks pretty damn cool too, actually. My oh, man's bulky as hell though. Um, it's just a matter of experimenting. And I think with a random outfit, if, you, if you're set on a specific combination with pickaxe and back bling this is kind of what i've started doing the last couple days because i just i kind of get overwhelmed with all of the possibilities i could be using so this is like a fun way to kind of experiment with your favorite back blings and pickaxes and kind of see what else it would kind of go with judging by what you have in your locker so let's do one more randomized okay uh it's not great but it, it matches you know what i mean the pickaxe ties it together let's do one more back bling and pickaxe and then we will wrap up this vid guys all right, guys, wrapping it up with para provisions and the bottom feeder harvesting tool. This is what it looks like on a default. So we can have some blues as well as browns, a little bit of chrome as well, judging by the back bling. It's got like a silver vibe to it. So let's randomize our outfit and see what we get. On Whiplash, um, it's not the best. Let's see one more time. I mean, I wouldn't rock it. I could, I could put a lot more on Whiplash, but considering like what you don't have, you really need to find back blings that go well with your harvesting tool. I feel like I've said it 30 times and I can't express it enough. See, this looks pretty good. The blues kind of throw me off, but nonetheless, it's not terrible. Not terrible. Default random. Um, it's okay. I could, I could probably rock this. The, the blue is a little brighter than like his, one of his like undercoats, but I don't think it looks terrible with bottom feeder. He's got the brown we're looking for. This is, this is kind of mind blowing. I need to do this more often. Okay, you can put anything on her, but not everything goes with her specifically. Yes, it's a black and white outfit, but Skull Ranger does not match everything. So with something like this, it looks pretty good. Let's do two more randomized. Um, okay, see, I, I don't really like this. I'm not gonna lie, I do not like that. Default, and then random one more time. Okay, uh, I'm not really feeling this either, but you guys get the idea. It's kind of fun to see what Fortnite gives you because if, if I was, you know, if I'm saying, okay, I wanna use a pair of provisions and bottom feeder, What's an outfit I want to use that has, you know, it has browns on it? Okay, I want to put it on Raptor, obviously. Is it going to look good on Raptor? Absolutely, but we we kind of already knew that. 
the point of this formula, it's um, it's Piso's secret formula. I don't even know what to call it. Is using the pointed out emote to quickly see in your locker what it's gonna give you for a random combo. So again, if I wanted something brown, um, roughly scrolling through, I could do bandolier. That's easy. That's an easy match. All right, bandolier. If I wanted another brown, I could do you know I could cop out and do something military again. And maybe I could run uh, maybe maybe not the best on a steel site. Maybe one of the um, what are they called scarecrow outfits. So we got straw ops. Um, not the best, but you can still blend it with the outfit. Let's um, do another one, which you would probably expect would go together. And I'm going to use this exact combo because I used it in my backlink showcase on um, Mary Marauder. And I think specifically this backbling Skelly and the propeller axe go really well together. So on a default, this is what we got. It looks sick. It's got what we want. Orange, green, some yellow, some, uh, uh, some we'll call it chrome. We'll call it like gun metal. So let's randomize the outfit and see what it gives us. Um, ah, I probably wouldn't wear it, guys. I probably wouldn't wear that. Didn't mean to do that. Excuse me. Come here, randomize again. Um, I would not wear it on the Dallas Cowboys either. So something that I would wear this on after we do one more random um i think that looks it looks decent it's not the best but it looks decent so if i actually wanted to rock scaly on um an outfit um let's say specifically uh to go with it of course we, we can throw it on like a pinocchio which is kind of a lot of green but you, you kind of already knew that would that would pretty much go well together um again a merry marauder non-burn style let's use that that looks really good with the pickaxe. He doesn't have a lot of the lime green we want, but the pickaxe ties it together. And one more, uh, one more I'd probably wear with this is Chromium. So let's do the pointed out emote, which is actually a lifesaver for looking at combos in your locker. So that's pretty much it, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Um, I guess it's kind of like an educational video, like I said. Um, it's almost easier to match outfits with the colors. It's harder to match outfits with things that you don't think would actually go together. For example, uh, that's a bad example. I would not wear that, but you guys get the idea. So with that being said, guys, liking the video is always appreciated. We got this guy again. Subscribing is free. Real quick, my supported creator within the item shop is P-I-Z-0. You do not have to use me, but please use somebody. Use an honest creator, guys. And we'll see you nerds on the live stream. This is not the best, not this is not the best example, guys, but you get it. Piso secret Krabby Patty formula. See ya!